Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So this is my England team. This is my England team uh, prediction for the Euros because the Liverpool games I've given up on for this season. For next season, I'll be doing like. Uh, I'll be doing um, uh, the Euros uh, group stages. I'll be doing all the match build-ups and all that. Then the, when the new season, I'll be doing the top six clubs, the top big six. So, yeah, guys, um, I hope you're looking forward to it. Here's my England squad prediction. Goalie Pickford, Jordan Pickford, my England squad prediction. This is England in goal. Pick Jordan Pickford, he's an, an incredible keeper. For yes, he, he's playing at the wrong club, but yeah. Um, then we move on to the left back. Luke Shaw for Manchester United has been amazing this season, and he deserves to go to the Euros. And yes, you got Cheerwell being on form, but do you see? Luke Shaw playing it. I do. I honestly do see Chewell playing. Um, Luke Shaw playing there because he's a great player. Then, yeah, look at that. So Pickford and Luke Shaw is my two players in the English squad. Then my two. Then my centre back, Harry Maguire. Harry Maguire. He can win the headers on the corner. This is what we need. We need a player like that on the corners. Like that. Building to a crescendo. So, yeah, guys. Um, and very shortly, it will be for real. We have all the action for. <laughs> so, yeah, guys. We, that's what we need. We need a player like. Um, we need a player like. Technically, like. Um, uh, Maguire because he's quite, he's slow at the back. Everyone can understand that he's slow at the back. He's a hundred percent slow at the back. And um, yeah, right. Well, moving on to the centre back, I've gone from one of the Liverpool centre backs, and that is Joe Gomez. He's an incredible centre back for Liverpool. Yes, he's made mistakes over the years, but I would rather play him over John Stones. So yeah guys, um let me know on my Instagram what you think about the English one because I think go Joe Gomez and Maguire at the back and Luke Shaw will defend that team and then let's be moving on. Um you're thinking who's gonna go on the right back, Luke? Well, My right back is going to be Trent Alexander-Arnold. He's played on a blinding start of the season. He had a great few games last few games of the uh, uh, season. So yeah, guys. Um, yeah, Alexander. And then there's been linked back Gareth Southgate picking. If Gareth Southgate did not pick Trent Alexander-Arnold, we will lose the. That um, we will lose the tournament because he can whip a crossing from 25 yards out. He will run down that wing. And we need a player like who's gonna gonna um, win win games for us. Um, yeah. And then moving on to the midfield field. <laughs> You're probably thinking, Luke. Who, well, you got so many good midfielders. My first midfielder is Mason Mount. What a player he has been for Chelsea. He's got him into the Champions League final. Yes, they lost to the um, FA uh, No, yeah, they lost the FA Cup against Leicester City. Congrats, by the way, uh, Leicester. But, yeah, um... 
Um, yeah, um... I mean, my thing on Mason Man, he can be a good player for England. I reckon, yeah, I do see us winning it. I can see us winning the tournament, I really do. I see it in England's eye, but if we don't pick the right squad, we will get knocked out. And yeah, here you go. That's my first midfielder. My second midfielder... It's got to be Jordan Henderson. Yes, he's had an injury this year, but I reckon he will be fully fit for the Euros. I want him back in there. He, he owns that midfield. He owns it for Liverpool. Um, yeah. Um, yeah, Henderson is nothing really to say to him because you haven't seen him much this season. So, yeah, moving on. Bill Bowden. What a play. Yes, he's got Man City the title. He's got the title. He's in a Champions League final, for God's sake. He's won the Caribbean Cup. Man City can still do the, tre the treble. So, yeah. Um, Bill Bowden. Honestly, I would have him at Liverpool. 100%. Liverpool, yeah, 100%. Then we move on. Yeah. 100%. Um, yeah. Um, moving on to the, the front three. <laughs> oh, and this is an exciting one. Please don't hate you guys, but on the left wing, I will have Marcus Rashford. 100% Marcus Rashford, he's been amazing for Man U, he's quick down that wing. And then you're saying play Sterling in it, but wait, just wait a minute, just wait a minute, just wait a minute. Um, Rashford is quick. Yes, he ain't, he can be lazy somehow, we all can say that, all players can be lazy. It's just a part of football, but yeah. Um, Rashford on the left, my... Striker, it's Harry Kane, and he and there's been news. He wants to move. He he wants out of Tottenham. He wants out of Tottenham. Um, yeah, shocking. Honestly, I do see Liverpool going for him, but why are we not going for him? We need a player. Yeah, no offense on the but Firmino, but. He doesn't score constantly like Salah, Mane, Jota and all them. Yeah, I can't see it. Uh, yeah. And yeah, um, yeah, I do see it, 100%. Um, yeah. Harry Kane up front. Then my last player on my starting eleven for England would be Rapping Sterling. Yes, I you think it's what Rashford is at, but Rashford is better on the left. Sterling is better on the right. So yes, I would have Rapping Sterling because he's quick for Man City. He's quick. He's he gonna pass defenders like they're not even there. There. You go. So this is my team again guys, if you didn't really catch all of that, but I'm going to have Pickford, Luke Shaw, Gomez, Maguire at the back, Trent at the back, uh, Mason Mount, Foden, Henderson, um, Rashford, Kane, Sterling, I hope you enjoyed that guy, guy, guy um, my, my start on 11 for England team, if I was the England manager. That would be my starting 11. 100%. That would be my starting 11. No matter what. Yes, we got good players on the bench. Sancho and all of that. On the bench. But yeah, guys. I hope you enjoyed that video. I'm sorry I haven't uploaded in a while. I just haven't, I just haven't been in the mood for it. But I feel like this is a good chance for it. But don't worry, guys. I will be doing my Europa and Champions League. Final prediction. Here you go, see.
please subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next video guys peace out bye guys